Hello, everyone. It's Mr. Dilophosaurus. You are the bane of my existence. I know, but I love you. <sighs> Anyways, everyone, today we're going to react to Filmcore's newest video, Evolution of T-Rex in Movies and TV Size Comparison 1918 to 2022. That's over 100 years of history, baby. With that said, you know what to do, Cougar. Hit play. Yes, hit play. I'm on it, boys. And whatever you are, Mr. Dilophosaurus. Ooh, look at all the dinosaurs. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm giving away not uh, uh, here we go with the ad again. No right. Oh, you're giving them away. I would like some free stuff. No, you don't get anything. Just get to the video, okay? Okay, that was the most entertaining ad I've seen in a while. Too bad we skipped it for retention reasons. Sorry, film quote. Please don't cover it. Comes. Oh my god, he got sucked into the TV and there was a little blow-up T-Rex thing. Yeah, that was funny. Oh, Ghost of Sonoma Mountain, 1918. That was over a hundred years ago. Yeah. You know, I really, really like that. <laughs> They're giving him the stop motion type movement like Ray Harryhausen. Good job, Film Corp. You are so much more talented than us here at uh, Cougar Studios. Yes, quite. Thanks, guys. Really, really make me feel good about all the hard work I put in on you. Yes, well, no one cares. Fine, whatever. Oh, Fantasia. Cougar seen that movie on a late night movie channel when he was a kid. God. That throws back memories, baby. For Kuga, not me. He just, you know, he talks through me. And me also. Does that mean he's a little fruity like me? No. Yes, he does. Okay, that one's actually pretty cool. Was that like a Doug McClure movie? I think it was. Oh, here we go. Okay, I'm almost positive this one is a Ray Harryhausen movie, if I remember correctly. Kuga's bad at memory, though. Yep, that is true. I like his little purple body. Oh, the last dinosaur, the failed kids movie made by Toho, if I remember correctly. Yeah, probably something like that. Oh, yes. You know, if you want to watch old movie reviews, check out Brandon Tennell, the awesome channel. Oh, yes, Planet of the Dinosaurs, classic, 1978. Beautiful stop motion recreation, my friend. Film go 100 out of 10. You are an artist. Can you stop kissing up the film corp? I just want to be in one of his videos, not Cougars. Fair enough. Oh my god, is that Clam? <laughs> Grimlock? Yes! Yes! Yes, baby! I did not expect him, but I quite appreciate it. Ah, yep. Prehistoric Beast, 1984. Cougar's never seen that one, but you know what? Maybe he'll watch it after this. What do you say, Cougar? Totally. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll be sure to do that after I pay off my crippling student loan debt. Oh, Sharp Tooth, Land Before Time. The one that scarred Cougar's childhood but made him obsessed with dinosaurs. Ah, Carnosaur. That's a classic. You know, for some reason, dinosaurs were birthed out of human stomachs in that movie. Yes, quite. Thank you, um, you know, Full Moon Production Studios for making that. Ah, Jurassic Park. Another reason Cougar's obsessed with dinosaurs. Yes, quite. Maybe that's why he made me so dumb looking. I actually tried really hard with these dinosaurs. You even have the next flappies. It's just, just, they're so heavy. Well, I don't care. I want to look fabulous. Well, neither do I. My arm is tired already. Ah, yeah. Cut him some slack to first. All right, it's fine. Oh, yeah. Buck, TLW, Jurassic Park. Let's go, baby. Yes, quite. Buck, the lost world. Oh, look, there's Buck's girlfriend. Yeah, though. Get it? Buck and though. That's not their names. It's like a male and a female. I, I didn't mess that up. Shut up. Oh, look, it's the little baby whose leg was broken used as bait. Yes, that turned out so well for the people using them as bait, right? Yeah, they totally weren't eating or anything. I remember Vince Vaughn was in that movie. Yeah, though. Oh, back to the Cretaceous. Cougar hasn't seen that in a long time. Hey, I'll be right back. Gonna go get some popcorn. Totally not fixing you anything. No, all right. Just ignore the hand on camera right now. Oh, dude, okay, you perfectly nailed walking with the dinosaurs. That is a perfect recreation of the weird-looking T-Rex from that series. Great job, Film Corp, baby. Yes, he's a distant cousin of mine. Really? No, I just felt like saying that. Ooh, when dinosaurs roamed America. Another classic one. Oh, look, it's the bull Jurassic Park 3. Isn't this the one that died? I think so, if I remember correctly. The, uh... 
what a weird looking dinosaur got him. Yes, if I remember correctly, it's been a long time since you watched Rex Park 3. Ah, that's Tessasaurus Rex, King Kong 2005. Totally pronounced that right. Yes, you definitely did. Remember when it's got a jaw snapped open in half? Yeah, that was a good piece of content right there. Yes, quite. Oh my god, I, pres I thought I forgot about Prehistoric Park. Oh my god, it looks so bad. Like, not from you, Film Court, just the design in general. Yes, it had that big, thick jaw. Eh, I'm not sure I count the dog bone thing as a T Rex. Well, it is a T Rex, it's just a bony one. Ah, alright, you win. I called it a dog because it plays fetch with the bone. Yes, we all know that's stupid. Oh, he's shaking his little tail over here. No, oh, grumpy land of the lost. You know, that movie completely bombed, but Cougar loves it. Yeah, he loves quoting Chaka all the time. Oh, yeah. Ice Age 3, been a long time since Cougar's seen one of those. Good recreation, though. Looks a lot like, you know, pretty much the animation from that movie. Ah, uh, Teeny the T-Rex, meet the Robisons. Another movie that no one remembers or talks about. It was that weird issue of, like, when Disney had that weird animation. Ah, Clash of the Dinosaurs. When dinosaurs looked like dinosaurs. Well, they actually look more like birds now. I'm talking about, like, childhood dinosaurs. No, all right. Jurassic Fight Club. Okay, I, I'm not gonna lie. I've never even heard of that, but I really want to see it. Is it like a crappy sci-fi asylum movie? Because Kuka worked on Lava Lantern 2 and Sharknado 5. No joke, he did. Yes, he did. He had bit parts in both. Ah, yep. You know, guys, I don't really want my real life bleeding into my channel. Well, too bad, loser. Ha, give a little look over. One Eye Dino King. Oh my god, I forgot about that movie. Ah. He did have a good design, though, I will say that. Stumpy Dinotasia. It rings a bell, but I don't quite know what film it's from to be honest. Well, I know it's Dinotasia, but I've never. It's been a long time. Oh my god, it's Grimlock again, and Grimlock died. Night night, Grimlock. I guess you died. Or something like that. Oh no, he's just taking a little nap. Oh, you're not gonna animate uh, Optimus Prime on top of him? Come on, man. Do it. I dare you, Film Core. No, oh, yes, the return of Jurassic Park, Jurassic World Rexy. You look beautiful, darling. The raw sounds really nice. Dude, Primal, legit one of the best animated series of all time. Calling it now. The way the second season ended, oh my gosh. So sad. Yes, yeah, squad, we better get a season three, I'm just saying. Ah, prehistoric planet. Still have not watched that. Neither have I. So, you guys mean I didn't watch it. Yep, pretty much. Oh, look, it's the little prologue, Rex. Jurassic World Dominion, yes. Hello, my friend. Can't wait to see that movie when it comes out. And don't worry, we're going to make a lot of dinosaur content when it comes to that. Run, my friend. Oh, are they all going to chase him? Yes. Murder the innocent people. Eat the blow up, T-Rex. Do it. You know, Film Core, even though like you make compilations, like you always throw some humor into it, and we absolutely love it. Yeah. Oh, favorite T-Rex? Probably the Ray Harryhausen stop motion ones. I just like stop motion. So do I. That's pretty much where the puppets got made, you know. Cougar's obsession with stop motion. Yeah, pretty much. Anyways, everyone, that was Film Core's amazing video. Make sure to check out the original link in the description. It's much better without us talking over it. Just saying, will you stop? You're killing our audience viewing. Okay, whatever you say, Godzilla. Anyways, have a good day, Beacon people. And remember, sometimes you have to risk it for the biscuit. And thank you so much for editing, Donut. You're so handsome. Stop hitting on Donut. Okay, fine. Goodbye. See ya, everyone. I'm gonna go deal with my life like this. Peace.